Long-term care homes are sounding the alarm of a potential new wave of COVID-19 outbreaks in light of major spikes in overall cases in California and other states. The American Health Care Association AHCA, and National Center for Assisted Living NCAL, warned Governor Gavin Newsom and other governors this week that, urgent attention, was needed to prevent further outbreaks in skilled nursing and assisted living facilities. They called on states to help expedite lab test processing times as well as on-site testing, to secure more N95 masks and gowns and to coordinate closely with long-term care providers in reopening facilities to visitors. About 40% of the state's more than 7.080 COVID-19 related deaths have been from nursing home residents, according to state data. As of Tuesday, hard-hit Los Angeles County, which makes up about a quarter of the state's population, claimed about 60% of the state's 2.804 nursing home resident deaths. Given the fact that the level of COVID in the community surrounding a nursing home is a leading indicator of cases in the facility, the major spikes of COVID cases in many states comes at a very challenging time as many states plan the reopening of long-term care facilities and return of visitations from loved ones, the letter to the National Governors Association NA, and state governors said. A recent ACA NCAL survey of nursing home and assisted living facilities found that 87% said getting test results from lab companies is taking two days or longer, while almost a quarter said it was taking five days or more, according to the organizations. California Health and Human Services Secretary Dr. Mark Ghali on Tuesday announced new plans for COVID-19 testing in the state, including updated testing guidance. With increased testing there's been growing delays in processing times, he said in a statement. The updated guidance prioritizes those who have COVID-19 symptoms and people without symptoms who fall into high-risk categories, including people who live and work in nursing homes, homeless shelters and prisons, healthcare workers and patients in hospitals, according to the agency. In addition, two new co-chairs will now lead California's testing task force a private-public partnership that has taken the lead in expanding the collection and processing of COVID-19 specimen testing. Dr. Michael Wasserman, president of the California Association of Long-Term Care Medicine and medical director of Eisenberg Village, a skilled nursing and assisted living facility in Reseda, said getting test results can take 48 hours or even a week. Nursing homes are often being required to test once a week but they don't even have the results back from the previous week, that's ludicrous, Wasserman said.